Good morning to everybody. It is Thursday. We're the Bacalus family. You're just your average family here traveling in the world. Um, traveling the world showcase tonight at Food and Wine. Oh, I didn't even plan to set that up. <laughs> um, Peter's working from home today. Working. I working am hard. not even edited yesterday's vlog yet because I just needed to do something before that. And she needed a cold pop from McDonald's. I did need a cold pop. From today's McDonald's. vlog is hashtag sponsored. Ooh, I'm putting the camera on the tripod as it records. That was unnecessary. Here we go, here we go, here we go. This is my jean jacket. This is what my project is. Last night it got to a blustery 70 degrees and I wasn't prepared with my jean jacket. Remember all those months ago when I was living my best life at the Andrew McMahon in the Wilderness tour, somebody in front of us in line had their jean jacket covered and buttons. Usually I put some on the collar, on the pocket. Um, this person just took it to another level and I was inspired. So luckily I used to run a button business. Now I just sell the buttons. So I have so many at my fingertips. So I'm gonna bowling out my jacket. I already started. This is called Food and Wine. <laughs> food and Wine. Everybody loves Food and Wine, apparently. You not like my fist bump. What? You gave me a dirty look. No, I was giving the, the these cards when I said everybody. Because everybody apparently loves Food and Wine. Oh, Tyler's meeting us and we forgot the magnet again. He, We've had the Donald annual pass holder magnet for Tyler for months. We keep forgetting it. Have fun. Thank you. In the famous words, we're it. We're it. I can't wait. Can we go? <gasps> I didn't show my jean jacket. And you didn't even bring it. It is 90 it's degrees right now. Right now. <laughs> I thought. Oh, oh my god, it's so busy. <laughs> Just wait. Don't you worry. In a couple of weeks, it won't be Labor Day weekend, and it'll be. Yeah, it'll be fine. It'll be empty. But by who would next, we be if we didn't go today. the first day? I need Greek nachos. There with Christmas and Thanksgiving. Yeah. Is food so and many wine. times are we. All I think about all year long, whenever I think about that kind of food and wine. How many times are we denied coming in the festival center? And now we're here. We'll go over again. First Beverly of Food and Wine. Gotta cleanse the palate before we go dive in. No? The ultimate tummy time with Tyler is Food and Wine, right? Yeah, but we've got three months, so. I know, yeah. we're only getting two or three things. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's Greek, it. Greek nachos and two other things. This girl is all jazzed up for the festival. What? What's going on? I've never been asked that before we lost. <laughs> Our first stop is Greece. 
for Greek nachos, loaded Greek nachos. They are pita chips, meatless sausage crumbles, and vegan tzatziki. Mm. Favorite table. My favorite table. I haven't even tried These yet. are much gonna... different than last year. No. Yes. Not too much different. I got, we got the nachos because I know Sarah secretly wanted them. But look how big this is. It's huge. And it's four fifty. This is probably the biggest item per dollar. Is it heavy? Amount. Yeah, it's heavy. Yeah, wow. And it's hot. They do actually look much different. Yeah, they're much different. <laughs> Darn it. Why do you doubt her? No, he just likes to think the best of things and people. Delicious? Oh, wow. Well. They're really good. I, tell, I call it a happy adult milkshake. Okay. Yeah. Do you like it better or worse than last year? I went on a date last week. I thought it went well. Apparently it did. Just the same? So, Alrighty, so the only reason I didn't like the nachos as much as last year is because I felt like last year they were they were much more like dense. Like we held them and we were like, this is... That's why she's mad. No, 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 no. Not at all. Do you know what else we're going to get? I don't, I really don't know. Food and wine. Food and wine. Everybody loves... Food and wine. Peter was enticed by India. You know what? I, we had I love curry. Uh -uh. You know, we had this during food and our flour and gutter or something. It wasn't these items. We'll come back. Yeah. Too spicy. We like spicy. So we're not getting anything until Italy, but we're passing by the Brewers collection. And I want to point out that for the, my people who love beer, there's a really good Zwickel. German beer, but it's unfiltered, so it's unfiltered Pilsner, so it'll have a little bit of that residue on the bottom, but it's such a good, heavy, good tasting beer. Definitely worth checking it out. I think Germany has a good, I just want to try everything, but like, pace, three months long. Festival is three months long, we gotta pace it out, because I'm gonna gain a bunch of weight and lose a lot of money if I don't. What is this, this is the, Rigatoni, vodka oh, sauce, oh. and pancetta. Yeah, all that good stuff. Sorry, this is what Sarah wanted. Tyler's got some cornbread looking I got thing. The, it's chicken with mushrooms, vodka sauce, and something else. Well, look at this awesome mug that Tyler got. It's empty. Um, I, I think it might be chicken with tomatoes, mushrooms, and Parmesan polenta, but I'm not sounds sure. Right. So sounds, it says in my passport right. booklet. <laughs> what do you think? Anything with chicken is good. Now I gotta get it in there. Okay, I owe a huge apology to the Italy Pavilion. I don't know if it was Festival of the Arts. One of the festivals here, they did not have a good menu at all. I think it's ev like basically every single one because we're just used to like authentic stuff and this always tastes like microwavable stuff. I'm and used to this? Authentic Chicago Italian. Don't you think, would you agree that this is, both these dishes are super good. Mm -hmm. The chicken was cooked very juicy with that chunk of cheese. This has got a, a spicy kick to it, but if you are like very sensitive, if you're sensitive to spices, it might just be too spicy. And if you want it vegetarian, you can ask without the chicken. Look at this creepy boat. What is that doing? No, but she's coming in hot. She's she like is. I think it's one of the boats for illuminations because they're already set up. Okay, so Tyler ran off because he found another CP friend or somebody. <laughs> and uh, we were just about to finish walking around the World Showcase to get our next dish, but we ran into some lovely friends of ours. Yeah, Matt and Julianne. Yeah, so thank you again. And put a comment down below, guys. Say welcome to Florida because they just moved here. And we're super pumped for them to move down here and like try to do what we were doing, like live in your best self in Florida. And we just want to say thanks for saying hi and congrats. Yeah. Well, they had said hi to us a couple of months ago, let us know they were going to move down. But it wasn't so, like set yet. Yeah, it's just so nice to see them here and they still like high five each other. Like, yeah. Did, so it's nice so. when like it's hard like it's super awesome when families not just moving to Florida but anything like you set you have your mind set on something and you wait till the stars align and you take but you just jump after your dream and that's what they did they kind of waited till the right opportunity came and then they're down here now so congrats thanks for saying hi and I'm sure we'll see you around. So cute the kids are so cute. All right so the final thing we're gonna get actually it's a shorter trip than we thought is Japan. Sarah really wants spicy roll so we got one Peter choice one Sarah choice Tyler got Italy. What? I want water. We're gonna get water from Morocco. We're gonna. Do you know what's got the best water? I'm thirsty, Mama. Do you know what's got the best water? So I would like to point out, food and wine last year, Japan kept doing us wrong. It kept by, like closing early. It kept closing early. We were never able to get it. Just now we get up there, and two of the three items were sold out. We'll get it this time. So Sarah said she wanted dessert from UK, since Japan didn't happen. 
But I just want to point out, this is the first and last time we're ever going to see the UK Pavilion during food and wine this empty. I'm kind of like appalled that it's this empty. Usually this place is like one of the hopping in places. Hip hopping, hopping it. Where's the music? Right, it is suspiciously quiet. Tyler, did you do something to the music? Huh? Did you do something to the music? Yeah, I turned it off with my phone. Kiss members can do that, you know. They can't do that. I've got access. No, he doesn't. Yeah. Alright, we're going to Ireland. There. So there's a sweet treat chocolate style. Julian Eber told us about it and we never got it. So, so we're gonna get it. Our warm chocolate pudding. Alright, this is a warm chocolate pudding. Tyler says he takes one small bite. Is it so good you'll have another? Have another, please. Have another, please. No, no, no. Have another. No, it's yours. Have it's another. Really, really good. Have another. Wow. That's really, really good. Oh, that is really good. What do you think? Good choice? We've never had that before. It's so good. I could eat 10 more. Who told us to eat it? Juliana Eber. Thank you, Juliana. I could eat a Portillo's cakes worth of that. Ooh. Could you eat a port like a like a Portillo's cake shake version of that? Oh yeah. What like yeah, literally the the cake is literally melting underneath that hot it's like pudding. Cake. It's like one of those brownie yeah. volcanoes Volcano. like from Chili's or Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's really good. I feel God in these chilies tonight. I'm gonna eat this whole thing. So what's wrong with that? <laughs> Here, that's my last little bite. According to Peter, we'll be back here 70 more times. I just need a little You don't think that's a valid statement? I'm gonna do the math. The odds of that happening are 70, 70 over the next three months. months out of the next 120 days. That's four months, sir. <laughs> that no four months is 100. <laughs> I don't know how many days are in a month. <laughs> I wish you guys could see his face. Do it again. Oh, bro. Oh, wow. <laughs> You're gonna be popular. <laughs> Happy birthday, David. Thank you. Yeah. How's it going? Doing great. Doing Peter great. was impressing people with his Beverly drink. I didn't mean to. Like, I, wasn't Beverly being, I wasn't being gaudy about it. It's just you like have you a family think... now, Peter. You have a problem. I, I'm never going to stop. There is merchandise all over the park, not just in the festival center. Just so you know. All right, so food and wine day one's kind of over. We're getting ready for eliminations. So we both like the food over. And we met a new friend. We have Alex here. Alex met Tyler at work, right? Yeah, I was at work and she came up to me in the hallway. Like, you know You're the tummy time! <laughs> you know the Brooke Hart's and I was like, I'm just, I did grow up with you. Yeah, we love that. <laughs> that's like the third person that you've met through us in the YouTube. Yeah, because yeah, we would have never talked. Yeah. Alex, I met you. Alex is going to get, and she's going to get a pass to the frequent, frequent fear pass. We're going to go to Holly Hart. If there will not go. <laughs> We're gonna go to Hollywood Horror Nights very soon. Okay, so our camera decided not to work mid illuminations. But this would be Peter and I. First day of food and wine. Let's get married. Look at this massive spider web outside of the Morocco Pavilion. Ooh. We're home. Sorry that the, that the last couple of clips are kind of all over the place. Our camera just won't, the lens won't go back in. So the lens is out. When you try to lens air, we'll shut down automatically, restart camera. And so yeah, we're gonna go to bed early. I'm not thrilled about this camera situation because no. I'm not, all the other times I felt more optimistic. To be honest, I'm not as optimistic this time.
but I'm gonna play with it in the morning. I need to like. It, let it had sit. some bleak moments in the past, so I'm just hoping that. I need to let it sit. I need me to sit mentally. I'm gonna play with it in the morning. Start tinkering with it in like not when I'm walking on a world showcase. So. Because. We're not in a place to be buying a camera right now. <laughs> but we'll see. We'll figure something out. Whether we use the gimbal and the cell phone for a while to stabilize it all and make it look fine. So, these are... We're going to choose between Elf and the song the song of Burned Up for our movie tonight. It's, it's good, good to, to be, be home. home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.